Hello, and welcome back to The City Beneath. We have finished Abyssian Fortress. And on, oh, that was a long level. Longest one so far. Onward to Upper Lowest. The patrons and the archivists agreed on very few things. The patrons, for example, felt that the surfacers were primitive yet harmless savages that must be guided and protected. The archivists, on the other hand, felt that they were primitive and dangerous savages that must be eradicated. So when a patron and an archivist met at a party, for example, they had to awkwardly skirt the issue of how dangerous above-grounders were, or what must be done with them, and stick to the safe topics of how primitive and savage they were. Had Bethro fully understood this complicated relationship, he may have been flattered to know that his latest exploits brought forth a rare instance of complete agreement between the two factions. The thing that both factions agreed and were even willing to cooperate on was simple. Bethro must not reach lowest point and they knew the perfect person to stop them. Hi, Elf. Orders from the bottom, Bethro. You can't descend. I'm blocking it off. Why? You're just going to mess everything up. Just like you always do, running around, killing everything that moves for no reason. You're stupid. You don't know anything. At least I try to understand things before I rush in with a sword and chop it all up. <laughs> There's no problem that can't be solved with a really big sword. Yeah. You always say that, and it makes no sense. That's what is wrong with this world. Jerks like you that can't learn a new way to solve problems. Alf, I was just joking. Of course. I don't trust you anymore, Bethro. Alf. I'm not talking to you. I mean, when your problem is a green door, killing things with a sword does tend to work out pretty well. Bill. Just stop building these walls. I gotta get to lowest point. Alright, so, builders. Um, somewhat controversial element, I suppose. I really like them, uh, but they can be used in really awkward ways. So, here, we have these build markers, and these guys are going to continuously make trapdoors for me. I need to get through before time runs out and I'm no longer able to access them. Okay, so I just have to choose which one I want, basically. Uh, this station looks good because it'll clear. I'm afraid I can't let you back the way you came either. I must keep you and many others safe. Okay. Flashing tiles show where the citizens are ordered to build. After gathering supplies, builders will go to the closest accessible build tile. You may click on a builder with the mouse to view its destination. Mm -hmm. So, I'll get to release one of them. That wasn't the destination you had marked. have to wait until I have access. Um, hmm. It's not good. Alright. Let's try this again. This time we'll use these babies to block his path. Problem is, this isn't actually working very well. Okay, we're gonna try a different station.
we go. Okay, so this one, we've got these arrows doing something funny. Okay, so only these two are going to go come out first. I need to switch this to mud for this to be killable. This is just a, a waiting puzzle. Yeah, there's a brain. See if it gives me something to do early. And activating the token stops you. Stops both of them. Okay. In that case. There we go. Should kill the serpents. Just waiting. Uh, mud actually should be killable now. Shows the worst time to try this. snakes first. It's those two. Oh. We couldn't finish this off anyway. Eventually, you'll grab one of those and give me access. I do need to keep the center clear so that you will eventually get in there.
shouldn't actually matter because as long as the goblins are released... the prior aren't going to finish everything off for me. I kind of thought they might, but... Quick! Dismantle the bridge! Oh no, you don't. Okay, so I need to... You don't. Well, that didn't work. Quick. This is awkward. Let's just change the timing slightly. Let's change the timing less slightly than that. No, you're not being very cooperative. This is just awkward. And now we're blocked on this side, so... Yeah, I mean, we killed everything, but we can't get across. Kind of a silly room. Uh, yeah, you can't just stab the, the builders, so sometimes that's just how you gotta do it. If I want to go back through here... Okay, they're gone now, so I can just pass through, really. No secret, for some reason I just had a thought suddenly. Alright, this room... There's a bunch of balls... What's with these arrows? Are they on broken walls? No. Okay, there might be... Might be a switch up here. I don't think going out of my way to kill that... Too slow. Trying to kill that brain at the beginning was bad. Let's see if they do anything different once they're done. Doesn't look like it. So 
So really, I just need to get to the end as quickly as possible. Now they're dismantling the wall, I guess because I made it to the end. Okay. I mean, there's not a whole lot to this room. It's just a matter of... Just a matter of killing some roach queens. here are just adding some extra little bit of chaos. They're not really making anything harder. and fuses. Well, the builders here are going to be helping me then. I don't want to do that. I want to wait. here potentially. Uh, there are tunnels here though. Ah. Okay. Oh, this worked pretty well. I was able to in there really quick. And just kill that one mud mother. Absolutely awful. Unfortunately. Do I need to fully clear all of this before I can do deal with this?
Yeah, so hitting this early didn't help me. Getting the gel early will. So maybe we'll just start here. Um... No, because I'm not getting back in time. Yeah, that's more than 15. So if I do that, I'm not getting back in time. So I can't do the gel first because of this. That was as fast as possible. Oops. So we'll start with the right side. too late. This has already grown in again. Okay, so this strategy, this strategy isn't going to work either. Well, then we go back with the first thing that we tried to do. some back and forth here. Is there a way to get this stuck with a baby here? No, if I have a baby here, I just lose. I 
can't even light this. Hmm, this is being a lot harder than I was expecting. Sword was a different orientation, this would have worked. I think I'm just a move too slow. Also, not really anything I can do about that, I don't think. to get it, but from here, I can actually just go here. And then we just do the same thing again. to set this off again, but how do I get there? I have to... So now I'm just stuck doing this again. again. Those. Can I be one turn faster? This is a very precise room. It's kind of annoying. Well, that's like the worst angle to have my sword. so many extra steps that time that, yeah, I'm not even close. Am I just in a lost state if all three of these are within a turn of causing problems? Still blow this up right now. Can't. Of course I can't. Okay, let's just sit here. Got stuck. And 
everything is just not quite working. This is still growing again. Okay, so we go up here. We have a couple of turns we can spare here. Can I get here again in time? No way. So instead of doing that, let's just take the extra turn here. turn faster? Why is it always one turn? No, that's not faster. It's going to be slower. go again. This one doesn't matter because it's just going to blow up again. So let's just do this. I think this is the timing I want. Yeah, because that gives me a turn. Um, it's still going to be close. Didn't enjoy that one. Some really, really fiddly constraints that just didn't quite. Um, like that, like setting something like this up would have been quite hard, I imagine, trying to get everything to just barely not work like that. Beast mode, do you feel how close you are? To lowest point? Quite right. What is lower than lowest point? I'm listening. I'm not going to waste your time by telling you. It's okay, really. You waste my time. Seriously, Beatro. Whenever I try to tell you something with just words, you don't understand it. I try to communicate much simpler things than this to you, and fail. Beatro, to keep a great fear is very hard. If I could just know that one person in the eight shares my understanding. Oh, the alleviation. The fear could rot us together. You're the only person worried about this thing. Whatever it is, so maybe you're just crazy. Ever consider that? You're the only person that came beneath to find truth. Are you crazy? No, I just want a few simple answers. There are no simple answers, but I gave you a simple question. What is lower than lowest point? Exactly. Lowest stir point, obviously. Okay. 
So Fit Thing makes an appearance. And there's our blue door. I guess that makes sense. Getting to the lower lowest. All right, so what do we got here? We have... We have force arrows. The force arrows do exist, but the ore mites do not. Okay, so for this room, I just need to... Kill a bunch of roaches. While I'm waiting for walls to come down. And I guess the upper part is looking a little bit closer. Uh, hmm. Got roaches in the middle now, which is unfortunate. Okay, we have a way up. This is getting really bad though, because how am I going to get up there in time killing all these roaches? Uh, I could actually... I could, I could just go in here. Yeah, that makes things way easier. Have I just never realized that? I remember this room being pretty hard, but I'm pretty sure I've never actually used that central area before. Obviously there is a time limit. I do have to get to the bottom before everything is covered in ore mites, but Let's just do this again. This will be easier, because I can kill them from here. Because there's no ore mites in the center. <laughs> Alright, not nearly as bad as I remember that one being. Okay, what's going on with this room? This looks a little bit complicated. You are putting hot tiles, it looks like. And also trying to seal my exit. Okay, well, if I beat you here... I can get out. Where are you going next? You're going here. So that means I can't deal with this right away. Okay. Uh, why did you switch? Because I put my sword? 
Because I did that. Okay. Just kill. Uh, you are going to be going for this one next. It was too slow. Does that mean I don't have time to kill this roach? I definitely do not have time. Okay. Could kill this. Stuck on that arrow. Good for me, I guess. have to kill these last two roach queens before I'm locked out. It should be lots of time, yeah. Too bad. That was if we went north. We don't go north. Okay. It's a trap. I know it is. Those guys will be starting something I don't like as soon as I step on the arrow. Well. Um, uh, welcome to the worst room in the entire hold, I suppose. I remember, I remember this one, and not for good reasons. Don't remain. There's a challenge here, too. Why? Um, so what's going on here is that we need to not drop this bridge. Well, okay, let's just, let's just... So I go in here. And what's going on is that these builders are now taking away all of these trapdoors, and when they do, this bridge falls and I die. So I need to continuously remove the central trapdoors in order to distract them while this guy builds the fuse. Now the problem with this is that it just feels incredibly random. There's not really a lot you can do to control this one, so you just kind of do it via trial and error until it works. And then there's a challenge to make it even more random. Because there's probably a way to cheat it that the challenge gets rid of. Don't remain on the edges of the bridge for more than one turn at a time. Right, so what the challenge is saying is don't use your body and sword to block a tile so that the builders can't do something. Exception, you may move onto the northeast corner tile of the bridge from another edge tile when exiting. Oh, so even going like that already lost me the challenge because I was by the, the edge twice, so I have to do that. And the only exception is when I'm coming out, I can step here and then here. I mean, I 
can stay here and block them. Does that help? one of them die? He was on a trapdoor when it got taken out by someone else. This is working... kind of? I think I just got lucky with one of the builders dying. Fuse is done. Did that work? <laughs> Bridge too far. Okay. Uh, I feel like I got really lucky with that one, but I'll take it. I was not looking forward to that room, so it's a, a big relief to just have it done. I guess this is the final room on the level. No secrets here. Uh, another challenge, maybe? Do not enter in any of the sandy areas more than once. Okay. But when I come in here, I have to kill all of the roach queens at once. When I come in here, I have to kill the entire rattlesnake. I have to cut all of the mud. Uh, what's actually going on here? There's a speed potion. Uh, oh, he's not building those. He's taking those away. Yep, another trap. Those little maniacs are gonna wall up behind me right when I step foot inside a corner chamber. What's that? What's going on here? Unfortunate. There we go. So eventually we get two of them, which makes everything slower, or it makes it so that they go through faster. So do I want to... I feel like the Rattlesnake is the simplest of them, honestly. And I don't like the idea of dealing with this when I have a bunch of... Yeah. I think that's pretty good, because dealing with the roaches here is the most uncertain thing.
Ooh, killed the rattlesnake. Oh, that starts it. the stable door. Okay, I guess I'm technically able to get out. Are you going to give up? Well, this is awkward. I mean, I have the challenge now, so I can go back in, right? Okay, let's just do this part faster. There's a there's another approach I could have taken to it. Way worse. challenge that time, but did I do something weird with stepping? No, I should have had the challenge that time. I'm not sure why it didn't trigger. challenge and actually beat the room. I'm afraid I can't let you back. Yeah, I'm back to go around. So yeah, the builders had a few interesting things that they did. Um, the problem with them is that Drawd is largely treated as a deterministic puzzle game these days, and it can be very difficult to predict what's happening when you have a lot of builders doing things. So sometimes it works out fairly well, like this room for example, I would say is a good use of builders. It's because it's very predictable what they're doing, they're just re restocking the bombs. The room itself I had a few issues with just in terms of how tight the timings were, but the use of builders in this room is actually pretty good, as far as the builder goes. Uh, this one, decent. But a lot of these are just chaos. I mean, this one is kind of neat. Chaos. This one's okay, I guess. It's just a timer that you can't really see very clearly. Uh, this one, just chaos. Yeah, chaos. It can be okay. Uh, it's like a horde room where you can't really predict how the horde is doing things. You just don't quit, do you? Bill. You idiots! Tear it down. So get away. All right. So that's it for upper lowest, and we go down to what I believe is the final level next time. I will see you then. <laughs>